I see this show as a really important test ground. What can sculpture do? Can it change the way that you engage with art, but in the process, can it change the way you engage with the world? What's the point of doing an exhibition? I think one of them is, yes, to show some stuff that you've made, but actually that's the least important. Maybe the most important is to ask that question, what, what can art do for us? What is the job that sculpture can do? And so, to test the idea of an exhibition itself, what is an exhibition? What can this combination of works do in terms of the narrative that each one of us that goes to visit that show makes out of it. And that's an open question, so it's not, you know, I don't, I, I, I don't think there is, there is no pre-given or intrinsic value to anything in this show until the viewer arrives, which is also the arrival of the subject of the show, because in the end, the viewer, singular, will be the subject of this show. And it's all about a celebration of making stuff. There is not a show like this in the world where, you know, someone like Anselm Kiefer or Marina Abramovich or David Hockney can show in the same space as Joe Bloggs. Everybody gets equal billing. It's a democracy, you know, of a sort. Very arbitrary one. I'm in charge. Uh, we are in Gallery 3, which I hung, and it's bright yellow because it's the summer show. Clues in the title. There was a strong kind of current events political sort of vibe going on, so I kind of amped it up. I started with the, uh, the portrait in the middle because I thought it was such a lovely piece, and then that became the kind of still centre of this sort of maelstrom of kind of agit prop and slightly dubious some of the works. I mean, we've got old Banksy here, then I put ne him next to this painting that I was rejecting, but then I brought it in because I thought next to the Banksy is kind of interesting. You know, this, it, what's that about? There's all little connections. You've got Jeremy Corbyn. Politics is very much part of contemporary art at the moment, you know, so in some ways in the hang in here, I try to put it in, in a sort of not too shouty kind of way. All I want people to come in here is to go, wow, look, there's a yellow room with a big pink panther in. And there's Nigel Farage. <laughs> When we were doing the sendings, we were looking at all the images of all the thousands of works. If you'd have asked me after we'd finished looking at the work that really stood out in my mind, it was this carpet bear. Because we just all looked at it and went, oh, like that, and we thought we're definitely having that one. This for me is the summer show. You know, these sort of works, that they're kind of, some people would call them kitsch, but I just call them high impact, because you've got to fight your corner in this show. There's a lot going on. <laughs>